Hi everybody and welcome to this new video. So today we're going to see together a very interesting exercise. It's about an inequality. Uh, it's an exercise of Mathematical Olympiad of 1995 and I've decided to share this video with you in English because a lot of my international students and students of my community uh, don't understand my videos in French so that's why I've decided to start to share with you some videos in English and this is the first the second one actually because I've already shared a video of Olympiad 2 you can you can find on uh, one of my playlists so today we're gonna uh, see together analyze together an exercise uh, which is very interesting because the, the inequality we're gonna see is really really um, really interesting and um, we will have to use some of the properties you probably know if you are used, familiar with uh, Olympiad exercises, inequality exercises, inequalities such as uh, Cauchy-Schwartz, such as Titus Lemma, or um, also the AMGM uh, inequality. But don't don't worry, we're going to see these inequ these inequalities together. So here we have three positive real numbers a b and c such that a times b times c equals to one and we have to prove that one over a cube times b plus c plus one over um, b cube times c plus a plus one over c cube times a plus b is greater or greater than or equal to three over 2. How can we do this um, inequality? How can we prove this inequality? So correction. Now of course if you want to pause this video, video and give this problem a shot, don't hesitate. It's very important to try by yourself actually. So here, um, the first thing actually we can notice here is that um, we have like fractions, an addition of fractions, and we can we can think about the Titus lemma. So I don't know if you know this lemma, Titus lemma. The Titus lemma is the following: states that um, if you calculate x y squared up to y one plus x two squared over up to y2 all the way up to xn squared over yn is greater than or equal to x1 plus all the way up to xn squared over up to over to y1 plus all the way up to yn. This is what we call the Titus Lemma. It's like uh, um, a simple case or a particular uh, case of um, Cauchy-Schwarz inequality. So here we can we can try to apply this Titus Lemma. It's my an indicator. You can pause this video and try to find by yourself. Otherwise, I'm going to show you how we can apply this lemma in order to prove the inequality we have to to prove here in the exercise so uh, the first thing is so let a b c be positive numbers what we're going to do is actually we're going to replace because to in order to apply the Titus the Titus lemma we have we need to have squares above the fractions so we can here notice that we have a condition a very important condition in the exercise um, the condition is a times b times c equals to one so we can replace here the one above each fraction at the top of each fraction by a 
um, a squared, b squared, c squared, because a times b times c equals to one, so a squared times b squared times c squared is equal to one, and we can replace one here, for example, by a squared, b squared, c squared over a cubed times b plus c plus a squared, b squared, c squared over b squared, b cubed times c plus a plus a squared, b squared, c squared over c cubed times a plus b. And here we have, we can notice that we can, each time we can um, simplify. So, um, by a squared here in the first fraction, b squared here, and c squared. So, um, we have b squared, c squared, over a times b plus c, plus a squared c squared over b times c plus a, plus a squared b squared times over c times a plus b. Okay? So here we can have like some squares actually. So b squared c squared, it's b times c squared, a squared c squared it's a times c squared and we have the same here a times b squared so so now we can apply this uh, this lemma Titus lemma so Titus lemma we have here our inequality, so plus one over b square cube a plus c plus one above c cube a plus b. So here if I want to apply my Titus lemma here to this expression, I would write a uh, so, it's greater, greater or equal, I don't have enough space, enough space here, so greater or equal to BC plus AC plus AB squared over A times B plus C plus b times a plus b, uh, a plus c, plus c times a plus b. Okay, so, if you're famili familiar with algebra, you know that here a times b plus c plus b times a plus c plus c times a plus b, this is equal to if you develop the expression, so we will have 2ab plus 2ac plus 2bc. So this is 2 times ab plus ac plus bc here. So we have proven now that, so therefore, we have proven that 1 over a cube b plus c plus 1 over b cube a plus c plus 1 over c cube times a plus b is greater than or equal to so here we we can actually simplify by a b plus a c plus b c so we will have only bc plus ac plus ab over 2. So,
Okay. And here we will have to prove that AB, A times B plus A times C plus B times C is over than or equal to 3. How can we manage to prove that? How can we prove? Let's prove that AB plus AC plus BC is over than or equal to 3. How can we prove that? Well, it's uh, not complicated actually. We have to apply the AMGM inequality. So, if we apply AMGM inequality, what can we write here? We can write AB plus AC plus BC over 3 greater or equal than AB, the radical cube, AB, AC, BC. And this is obviously equal to ABC squared. And you know that A times B times C is equal to 1 according to the, the condition here in the exercise. So, we will end up with 1. So, AB plus AC plus BC over 3 is greater than or equal to 1. And consequently, and so, therefore, AB plus AC plus BC is over than or equal, is greater than or equal to 3. And so, we have proven our inequality, 1 over a cubed times b plus c plus 1 over b cubed a plus c plus 1 over c cubed times a plus b is greater than or equal to 3 over 2. So that was one of the most elegant inequality problems I know. If you like, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a comment. If you didn't enjoy, leave a comment also because I'm always open to hearing your suggestions. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit the bell of the notifications so you get notified whenever I post.